Well, a very good morning. I'm coming to you with an update from Joel Senyonyi's camp. Well, another person has been killed in cold blood right here in Kampala. Well, stand by for the details. This is the Buzz UG, and my name is Melads Milo, aka Fuller. Subscribe to the Buzz UG in case you haven't, and also tap on the bell for all the notifications. Now, Nakawa West Member of Parliament, Horrible Joel Senyonyi, yesterday revealed that he received a call from Horrible Minister of Tourism, Tom Butime, threatening and intimidating him over Uganda Airlines investigations. Now, Joel Senyonyi claims the minister threatened him to quit the investigations, otherwise he will be attacked by Jennifer Bamuturaki's friends and family members. Now, Senyonyi has reported the matter to Central Police Station and the police says they are ready to take on this case. <laughs> Jennifer <laughs> Nengamba <laughs> Bakola ba, ba analysis, Gabamazo Kola analysis, Baja to where is a report. Awe Tugenda Kusinzira, Okolo, Okonon is Okudapo, Nah two fu, Kamazo Gula Owano, file the Twitter general inquiry file. Well, there you go. Now, moments after Joel Senyonyi posted this matter on his social media platforms, NRM's Balam Barugahara replied him saying, you will do nothing. She will remain in office as long as she's interested. He's talking about Jennifer Bamuturaki. She will remain in office as long as she's interested. We shall even demonstrate for her salary increment. She was appointed by God's angel in Uganda, Kaguta Museveni. <laughs> so in Uganda right now, we have an angel in President Museveni. Wow. <laughs> there you go. That's the arrogance President Museveni's supporters, especially those close to him, have started showing to the rest of us Ugandans. Uh, what can we say? But time is the best teacher. We are watching. I'm sure many Ugandans have saved this statement from Balam Barugahara. And by the way, time is coming. They will remind him about it. Well, in other news... Uh, Uganda police is hunting for unknown assailants that killed the fuel station guard in Lusaze, Ruaga division, and took off with his gun. James Amuriat, a security guard attached to SGA, a security company, was shot dead at Nesta Petro station yesterday before his attackers made off with a bundle of 500,000 Uganda shillings. Well, according to the eyewitnesses, the incident happened at around 9 p.m. in the evening and the killers first bought petrol before shooting him. 9 o'clock, I received a phone call from one of the bumper tenders who is working here about what happened. He told me that one of the security guards has been shot by two men and after sh shooting the man, he took away the gun. Well, 
kati obudde obutwade abamu tuli mu kwa makabe eno wagulu twagenze ola masas isoke libuganga manyo oba just askari mundu emus emusima tuseko na esas ne difuma mu butanwa kati ngendo okuda mu tulanga bedale lyo covid well, the shooting is one of the incidents in and around Kampala where armed robbers have gunned down innocent people and run away with their guns. There is a lot of collusion and connivance between the perpetrators of these crimes and those who are in the security circles, especially police and those intelligence networks. So they are, they are people who are there, who have mastered the system, who know how to, to, to manipulate it in collusion with the perpetrators of these crimes and eventually you see the escalation of these incidents. Now, the residents of Lusaze are now living in fear. A shooting of civilians and gunmen taking off with guns has continued to rise and people are wondering whether security is on top of the situation. For now, we don't know what will happen next because the can that was Ascar revolting is in the wrong hand now. But Kampala Metropolitan Deputy Spokesperson Luke Owesijire says the force is investigating these incidents. I believe uh, members of the public should remain uh, firm, work with the authorities that are elected to serve them and also the police that is within their vicinity to see that they without crime in their locality. I can notably come out and conclude that their intention is to further maybe acts of terrorism or robberies, but what we know is that guns are being stolen. And uh, we believe they are the same guns that are stolen that are facilitating uh, these kinds of criminal activities that are happening. Well, there you go. That is Luke Oweisijire uh, speaking right there. That is the latest update I have for you right here on the Buzz UG. But before I wind up, I want to send my regards to the following people. Hash Greed, Gerard Biavashaija, Binzika Victoria, Bale Soft. Oh, you guys always comment on my stories right here. Uh, then uh, Shakira Mutesi, The Blacks, Immaculate Gifts. Miley, is it Mili or Miley? <laughs> Something like that. Then Carveto Bernard and many others. You guys always comment on my stories. I want to big up to you. And, uh, you know, you can as well invite your friends to come and be part of us right here on the Buzz UG. Yes, my name is Melanz Milo, aka Fula. Thank you so much for subscribing. In case you haven't, kindly subscribe and also tap on the bell for all the notifications. <laughs> <laughs>